The law of Nam Myoho Renge Kyo is the fundamental principle of Nichiren Buddhism. It encapsulates the essence of the teachings of Nichiren Daishonin, the founder of this faith. In this chapter, we will explore the significance and power of Nam Myoho Renge Kyo, shedding light on its transformative potential. Let us dive deep into the heart of this law and draw inspiration from the writings of Nichiren Daishonin. Nam Myoho Renge Kyo is a Sanskrit phrase that can be translated as, devotion to the mystic law of the Lotus Sutra. It represents the fundamental rhythm and essence of life, the dynamic force that permeates the universe. Nichiren Daishonin revealed that by chanting Nam Myoho Renge Kyo, one can tap into the limitless wellspring of wisdom, courage, and compassion within. Through the practice of chanting, we awaken our innate Buddha nature, our highest potential for enlightenment. Nichiren Daishonin states, This is the vow of the mystic law, it will manifest its power, if you have faith. It will not do so merely because you do not have faith. This powerful quote reminds us that our faith and dedication are essential in unlocking the transformative power of Nam Myoho Renge Kyo. Chanting Nam Myoho Renge Kyo is not a mere repetition of words. It is a profound invocation that resonates with the depths of our being. It is an expression of our determination to overcome obstacles, transform our karma, and manifest our highest aspirations. Nichiren Daishonin writes, If the minds of living beings are impure, their land is also impure, but if their minds are pure, so is their land. The law of cause and effect is central to Nichiren Buddhism. Our thoughts, words, and actions create causes that shape our present and future circumstances. By chanting Nam Myoho Renge Kyo, we align ourselves with the positive life force of the universe, paving the way for a brighter future. Nichiren Daishonin emphasizes, if you wish to free yourself from the sufferings of birth and death, you have endured since time without beginning and to attain without fail, unsurpassed enlightenment in this lifetime. You must perceive the mystic truth that is originally inherent in all living beings. Nichiren Daishonin teaches that faith in the mystic law empowers us to navigate life's challenges with wisdom and strength. By chanting Nam Myoho Renge Kyo, we gain the courage to confront our fears, transform negativity into positivity, and create harmony in our relationships. He writes, chanting Nam Myoho Renge Kyo is like the roar of a lion. What sickness can therefore be an obstacle? The power of Nam Myoho Renge Kyo extends beyond individual transformation. It has the potential to bring about peace, harmony, and enlightenment to society as a whole. Nichiren Daishonin writes, great and small alike, meet obstacles and difficulties because of their past karma. But if Nichiren's disciples, who chant Nam Myoho Renge Kyo, meet with obstacles, they will not only eradicate these sins but also purify the six sense organs of the five components. The law of Nam Myoho Renge Kyo is a profound teaching that offers a transformative path to enlightenment. By chanting this powerful mantra, we awaken our inherent Buddha nature, tap into boundless wisdom, and manifest our highest potential. Nichiren Daishonin's writings inspire us to cultivate unwavering faith, courage, and compassion in our journey of self-realization and societal transformation. As we chant Nam Myoho Renge Kyo, we develop a deep connection with the mystic law, creating a ripple effect that positively impacts our environment. Nichiren Daishonin affirms, when we practice this sutra, we embody the principle of the true aspect of all phenomena and reveal the true entity of all phenomena. Through our dedicated practice, we become beacons of hope and inspiration, spreading peace, compassion, and respect in our interactions with others. The law of Nam Myoho Renge Kyo teaches us the importance of perseverance in the face of adversity. Nichiren Daishonin encourages us, saying, even a feeble person will not stumble if those supporting him are strong but a person of considerable strength, when alone, may trip and fall. By connecting with fellow practitioners and drawing strength from the collective energy of the Buddhist community, we find solace, encouragement, and the determination to overcome any obstacles that come our way. Furthermore, the power of Nam Myoho Renge Kyo lies in its universality. It transcends cultural, geographical, and linguistic barriers, embracing people from all walks of life. Nichiren Daishonin emphasizes, there is no special secret to chanting Daimoku. It is just that you should chant regardless of whether your voice is good or bad, loud or soft. 
The simplicity of this practice allows anyone, regardless of their background or circumstances, to engage with it and experience its transformative effects. In the writings of Nichiren Daishonin, we find numerous accounts of individuals who have experienced remarkable changes in their lives through the practice of Nam Myoho Renge Kyo. These stories serve as a testament to the power of faith and the law. They remind us that within each of us lies the potential for enlightenment and the ability to create a positive impact on ourselves and others. In conclusion, the law of Nam Myoho Renge Kyo is a guiding principle of Nichiren Buddhism that encapsulates the transformative potential of chanting. Through this practice, we tap into our inherent Buddha nature, cultivate wisdom, and manifest our highest aspirations. The writings of Nichiren Daishonin inspire us to embrace this law with unwavering faith, understanding that it has the power to bring about personal enlightenment and societal harmony. Let us continue our journey of chanting Nam Myoho Renge Kyo, connecting with the mystic law, and unlocking the boundless potential that resides within us. As Nichiren Daishonin states, one who hears the law and rejoices greatly is called a Bodhisattva of the earth, a Buddha who appears in this world, a votary of the Lotus Sutra. May we all become true votaries of the Lotus Sutra, spreading peace, compassion, and wisdom in our lives and in the world around us.